Power ingredient, brown butter salmon, so easy and so good. First heat your pan on a medium high heat and melt your butter until it browns like so. Then add in some honey, minced garlic, and freshly squeezed lemon juice. Once you mix in that lemon juice, add your salmon fillets. I'm adding four pieces and then baste the top with those sauces for about four minutes. Then I'm gonna add some lemon wedges just to make it look nice and pretty. Season with salt and pepper and then broil on high for about four to five minutes. And that is it, so easy. Enjoy. This chicken biscuit pot pie is the definition of a comfort meal, and it's made with canned biscuits and store-bought rotisserie chicken, so it's easy to make. In a pan on medium heat, add four tablespoons of butter and two tablespoons of flour. Whisk until smooth, and then add a half cup of diced onion, a half cup of thinly sliced carrots, a half cup of chopped celery, fresh thyme, about four cloves of minced garlic, and a half cup of dry white wine. Cook for about one minute and then add one cup of corn and one cup of peas straight from the freezer. Then add two cups of chicken stock, one deboned and shredded rotisserie chicken, and one cup of heavy whipping cream. Then season to taste with some chicken bouillon, regular or smoked paprika, and black pepper. Add your filling to a baking dish, then get a can of eight big biscuits and arrange them on the top of the filling. Then bake at 350 degrees for 25 to 30 minutes or until your biscuits are golden brown. The biscuits will be a normal texture on top, but doughy like a dumpling on the bottom so you get the best of both worlds. Follow along for more recipes and enjoy!